っとやっていこうねスタンディースタンディーさんせーのなんか久しぶりなんだよねここのさ席って何かあんのかな、まあ、すんごい調べたわけじゃないけど例えばここに長時間いると何かエンディングがあるとかっていうわけじゃないのかなまだねウィキは全然見てませんなんか自力でいろいろエンディング探した方が面白いかなと思ってそこまでなんか難しい感じじゃなかったからねおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおお What if a crucial outcome fell under his responsibility? He had never been trained for that. No. Oh, oh, oh. This couldn't go any way except、eh? badly.、Oh, The thing、not? to do now, Stanley thought to himself, is to wait.、Mm. Nothing、Max. will hurt me. Nothing will break me. In here, I can be happy forever.、Mm, happy, happy. <laughs> I will be happy. Oh, happy. Stanley waited. Hours passed. Then days.、Eh? Had years gone by? He yeah, no longer yeah, had yeah, the yeah, ability yeah. to tell. But the one thing he knew for sure, beyond any doubt, was that if he waited long enough, the answers would come. Eventually, someday, they would arrive. Soon, very soon now, this will end. He will be spoken to. He will be told what to do. Now it's just a little bit closer. Now it's even closer. Here it comes. Oh! あ、最終回<笑>あこのドアを閉めるんだねはあそうだよねいつも勝手に閉まってたんだよねこう出るとそういうことだったんだで多分また閉めるとは別のエンディングになっちゃうからこういうのは違うんだで開かないんだへえこういうエンドもあるんだ引きこもりエンドみたいな<笑>スタンリー decided to go to the meeting room perhaps he had simply missed a memo no matter how hard スタンリー looked he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers なんか戻れるところはなんか怪しいような気もするけど開かないもんね、マットは。<笑>なんかドアがさ勝手に。スタンリー went around touching every little thing in the office, but it didn't make a single difference, nor did it advance the story in any way. 今いたよね。今スッって。じゃあちょっとその時の VTR どうぞ。今あったよねいや、俺はそのさ、VTR は見れてないんだけど、<笑>編集の段階で入れるから、見えてないけど、いたよね。でもなんか、ちょっとスタンディーっぽかったな。スタンディーの幻影実はスタンディーしかいない。っていうパターンびっくりしたほらほらほらインプットって前俺前前2だと思ったんだけど違うのかな誰かいるんじゃねえねやっぱあれサンディーなのかな人が通らないでちょっと気になりだしてきた When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Ah, just a little bit of 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 a little bit Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. 
Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. Shocked, unraveled, Stanley wondered in disbelief who orchestrated this. What dark secret was being held from him? What he could not have known was that the keypad behind the boss's desk guarded the terrible truth that his boss had been keeping from him. And so the boss had assigned it an extra secret pin number. 2845. But of course, Stanley couldn't possibly have known this. Yet incredibly, by simply pushing random buttons on the keypad, Stanley happened to input the correct code by sheer luck. Amazing. He stepped into the newly opened passageway. <laughs> Descending deeper into the building, Stanley realized he felt a bit peculiar. It was a stirring of emotion in his chest, as though he felt more free to think for himself, to question the nature of his job. Why did he feel this now, when for years it had never occurred to him? This question would not go unanswered for long. Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. Although this passageway had the word escape written on it, the truth was that at the end of this hall, Stanley would meet his violent death. The door behind him was not shut. Stanley still had every opportunity to turn around and get back on track. <laughs> At this point, Stanley was making a conscious, concerted effort to walk forward and willingly confront his death. As the machine whirred into motion and Stanley was inched closer and closer to his demise, he reflected that his life had been of no consequence whatsoever. Stanley can't see the bigger picture. He doesn't know the real story, trapped forever in his narrow vision of what this world is. Perhaps his death was a fluke loss, like plucking the eyeballs from the blind man. So he resigned and willingly accepted this violent end to his brief and shallow life. Stanley. Farewell, Stanley, cried the narrator as Stanley was led helplessly into the enormous metal jaws. In a single visceral instant, Stanley was obliterated as the machine crushed every bone in his body, killing him instantly. Oh, 
So, Stanley probably. And yet it would be just a few minutes before Stanley would restart the game back in his office as alive as ever. What exactly did the narrator think he was going to accomplish? When every path you can walk has been created for you long in advance, death becomes meaningless, making life the same. Do you see now? Do you see that Stanley was already dead from the moment he hit start? ほう。あ。スタンディーズコンピューター。なんか。博物館的な感じに。お。あ、レイアウトだ。おお。で、ここで。ここで。別れるって。え、これ何か関係あるのかなこれ。これこれこれ。ちょっと。あ、あれ、あれなんかこのゲーム見たことある。なんかこの意味があるのかもしれないね。このこの机とかもさ。ちょっとやり直したい。01座オフィス。ああ、いたところで。裏側はスカスカなんだ。これこれこれこれ。あ、セレクションオブザサウンド。うん。クレジット。最終回、なんか最終回っぽいね。ボス。ボスオフィス。なんか違うオフィスもあるの別バージョン何こっちないトイレかなんか。いや、なんか結構革新的な。これ、トゥルーエンド的な感じなのかなこれ、これ、これ、これ。あ、でもなんかちょっと
、俺、俺押してないよ。これ、これ、これ、これ、これ。<笑>この、これになんか送ると。くそ、押せない。勝手に進む。ちょっと理解できないな。英語がわからん。HD リミックスとか書いてあるけど<笑>なんかいろいろうわうわ何これこんなのもあんのえ何これ知らないよあーこれも後で翻訳しよう何これファックスにもなんか関係してたっぽいあなるほどじゃあちょっと適当に行ってみようかほらなんかどこどこどこ誰電話だ何あこんなとこあったっけかおああーでここにつながるのねいやーこれも後で読みてシャキも何か意味あったワンオプション、ツーオプション。あ、これなんかメモりたいな。ラウンジまで行く。な何か行く方法、違うかな。じゃあ行きますか。行くぜ。おお、look at these two。how they wish to destroy one another。How they wish to control one another. How they both wish to be free. Can you see? Can you see how much they need one another? No, perhaps not. Sometimes these things cannot be seen. Listen to me. You can still save these two. You can stop the program before they both fail. Push escape and press quit. There's no other way to beat this game. As long as you move forward, you'll be walking someone else's path. Stop now and it'll be your only true choice. Whatever you do, choose it. Don't let time choose for you. Don't let time. えー、終わり本当にああ<笑>最初にも戻らないはい<笑>本当に死にました何だったんだろうあの,あの博物館でもなんかすごい肝のような気がする攻略のね肝っぽい感じがするけどなんかまだまだ見てないところがあるでは、ご視聴ありがとうございましたスタンリー・パルの最終回じゃなかったでは<笑>